Hi everyone, I hope you're all doing well. So if I double tap on my back side of my phone, my phone will automatically take a screenshot. This is the same feature as iOS 14 on iPhones. So if you wanna know how to enable this feature on any Android phone, make sure to watch the video until the end. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy. Alright guys, so since the launch of iOS 14 and the new iPhone 12s, I'm sure you've seen videos of people having their iPhones taking screenshots or launching applications by double tapping or triple tapping on the back side of the phones. And I'm going to show you how to do that on any Android phone, so make sure to stick to the end and enjoy it. Before we head into the tutorial, if you're watching this video, that means you're one of those 95% of people that are not subscribed to the channel, so make sure to subscribe to the channel to watch my peer to videos, and it will be greatly appreciated if you do so. So that being said let's go into the tutorial so i'm going to show you all the steps that are necessary in this video to work the list in the right hand side of the screen that you see are the instructions in case you don't follow up with what i'm doing on my screen but other than that i'm going to show you how to do it so the first thing you need to do is download an application from the description box the link is available there so just tap on it and then it will take you to the download link once you're there, just wait for the application to be downloaded. And after that, I'll show you how to install the application. So as you can see, I'm just shown with a prompt that lets me download the application. And in case you don't see that Google Drive link, make sure to open the link, which is also in the description and choose the last one from this list because that's the latest version of this app. Now, make sure to subscribe to the channel as well and turn on the notification bell because I make mostly videos that are going to make your phone easier to use and it will make your life easier as well. So that being said, the application is just downloaded. It's in your file manager downloads folder. So just go there and then tap on the application that it's called tap. So the application is simply called tap. All you need to do is tap on it and then install the application from your file manager. Wait for the application to be installed and I'll show you what you need to do. So after the application is installed, all you need to do is open the app and then wait for the application to load and tap on get started. Afterwards, you need to activate the feature by double tapping on your back side of the phone. So just easily double tap on your phone. Make sure you double tap without having your fingers move around that much so it activates the feature. After it gives you the check mark, all you need to do is tap on next. Afterwards, make sure to tap on next once again and then you need to tap on this feature which calls enable services. Once you tap on that, make sure to choose this option that's called tap tap and then enable it. Afterwards, tap on next and you will be shown with a prompt that says disable battery optimization. It's necessary for you to do this so just make sure to disable that and you will be shown with this screen that allows you to have multiple features unlocked. Our main focus is on double tap and triple tap so if you tap on the double tap actions you will have the launcher assistant automatically set on default so just remove that and then keep on the screenshot which this allows you to take screenshots by double tapping on your backside so if you want to change this feature you can easily just tap on add actions and you can uh, add as much as features as you want but don't rush it i'm going to show you what are the perks of this app besides the double tap so as you can see it took a screenshot just by double tapping on the backside now if you go back and tap on triple tap it will also have options to enable features using that triple tap on the back side so as you can see mine is set on open notifications but if you tap on add actions you can have your triple tap do things like launching apps for example you can have it launch the youtube application or facebook or any other app that you use most of the times and by doing this you will not have the necessity to go and unlock your phone it will automatically open that application for you just by triple tapping on your backside. As you can see, there are other features as well. For example, you can, uh, like I said, choose the launch application. So let's let's do it for YouTube. But uh, before I do that, make sure to choose double tap for this feature because double tapping is easier for the phone to be recognized. So as you can see, if I search for the YouTube application and then set that as my default action, once I double tap the backside of the phone, it will obviously and automatically open the YouTube application just that fast. So as you can see, I'm going to do it again just for the sake of this video. As you can see, it will run the YouTube application if I double tap on my backside. So with that being said, you can also have other actions 
once you triple tap or double tap your home button. For example, you can set it to do something else when your phone is locked. For example, if your phone is locked and you double tap it, it can unlock your phone. However, if you're on the home screen and you double tap it, it will launch the YouTube application, for example. You can change all these features within the settings, so it's very easy to use. As you can see, that's how you move around and play around with the application. So just to further explain the features of this application, you can also adjust the sensitivity of the taps here. You can make it fast or slow for it to recognize your, uh, your fingerprint or your fingers. Okay, so as you can see, there are a lot of options here. You can uh, let it uh, turn on the flash flashlight or you can have it uh, turn off the Wi-Fi or turn it on. There's a lot of steps and features in this application. All you need to do is just look around which one can, uh, is more convenient for you and you can choose that as easy as choosing or tapping an option. So with that being said, that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. If you have any issues downloading the app or facing any struggles or difficulties, make sure to comment below. I will most likely reply to all of my comments and I will try to help you or make you your can also have other actions by, uh, once helping you triple tap or double tap. So your thank home you so button. much for, for example, watching. you can set it to do something else when your phone is locked. For example, if your phone is locked and you double tap it, it can unlock your phone. However, if you're on the home screen and you double tap it, it will launch the YouTube application, for example. You can change all these features within the settings, so it's very easy to use. As you can see, that's how you move around and play around with the application.